Weasel News. A record producer carjacked in Los Santos. Five die thanks to dodgy smack and orgy. A man camping in line for three months for a phone is in critical condition. Adventure funerals are a hot new way to die. We wanna go out tonight. We don't wanna be What up guys it's your boy so fly so joe one and today i bring to you how to fix one car a day selling limit step by step tutorial this step by step guide will help you fix the problem you're having when you can't sell more than one car per day this will fix your selling limit so you can sell up to eight cars a day again like normal and help you regain your custom license plates back unfortunately there is no other easy way to fix this problem faster we screwed up now we have to grind to get everything back to normal again. This method 100% works and will take up to 2 weeks, but that's better than waiting a 60 month 1 car selling limit and license plate ban. You will need to sell 6 to 8 clean cars without setting off the dupe detection system, or hitting your daily selling limit plus 1 car. This means if your daily sell limit is 1 car you will need to purchase 21 to 27 clean stock cars, then upgrade and sell them without going over your daily sell limit to restore your plate options. You will need to continue selling cars to further increase your daily sell limit. Do not sell cars that sell for 1 million, do not sell cars that you receive from friends, do not sell cars if you do not have a option to put a custom plate on a car, knowing you have plates, these are called dirty dupes, when your plate doesn't show up in the mod shop, or you lost them. Best way to check to see if you still have custom plates is to bring a street car in Los Santos mod shop and if you don't have a option to pick your custom plates, then you have lost your plates. Do not buy free cars, elegies, or a group of the same car, switch it up. You can sell your cars that you legit bought and didn't mod that you already own, but I do not recommend selling 1.8 or 1 million dollar future shock isis or anything you got from glitching do not sell dlc cars sell cars that were originally in the game before all the dlc came out i personally bought a few of rusty rebels from southern san andres for 6k and upgraded them and sold them to get the job done buy cheap vehicles do not sell street vehicles I try to tell people all the time do not sell any slam vans or isis you obtain from gift cars to friends glitch. This will land you in hot boiling water and will be dupe detected. Make sure you guys are keeping track on when you sell your cars. Set a timer on your phone or write down the information. Make a chart with day 1 all the way till day 43 and times of when you sold cars. You want to have a daily schedule. Track this information down and don't forget to avoid selling too soon and hitting your daily sell limit. Do not accidentally press sell in Los Santos Customs when viewing your vehicle, this will trigger the daily sell limit or dupe detection which will slow down the process. Now next I am going to show you guys on the screen a daily chart on when and how Haney cars and the days on which to sell your cars, this is important. Follow this guide 100%. I will help you get through this. Day 1, open your iFruit app and create a new custom plate for any stock car. Do not sell this car, you will need to keep this car and the custom plate RO receive the alert when your plate options return. Next buy 10 cheap cars from San Andreas Auto or use your clean cars you own and ready to sell. Upgrade each car with something cheap, like brakes, paint, or engine. Store the cars in a empty garage and wait at least 30 hours since your last car sale. After 30 hours has went by, sell one car or number one and then wait 30 hours. Now that you have sold a car and waited 30 hours, let's continue. Day 2 through 7 Daily Sell Limit 1 
So on day 2, sell car number 2 and wait 30 hours. Day 3, sell car number 3 and wait at least 30 hours. Day 4, sell car number 4 and wait at least 30 hours. Day 5, sell car number 5 and wait at least 30 hours. Day 6, sell car number 6 and wait at least 30 hours. Day 7, sell car number 7 and car number 8 back to back. If car number 8 sells then your daily sell limit has increased to 2 cars a day, and you're on daily sell limit level 2. Day 8 through Day 11 Daily Selling Limit 2 Day 8, sell car number 9 and number 10. Wait 30 hours. Day 9, sell car number 11 and number 12, wait 30 hours. Day 10, sell car number 13 and car number 14. Wait 30 hours. Day 11, sell car number 15 and number 16. Wait 2 hours, and then sell car number 17. If car number 17 sells, congratulations, you are now daily selling limit 3. Wait 30 hours to continue. Day 12 through 15 daily sell limit 3. Day 12 sell car number 18 and number 19, wait 2 hours. And sell car number 20. Wait 30 hours. Day 13 sell car number 21 and car number 22. Wait 2 hours. And sell car number 23. Wait 30 hours. Day 14, sell car number 24 and car number 25. Wait 2 hours. And sell car number 26 and number 37. If car number 27 sells, you are now daily selling limit 4. Congratulations you should now be able to get your custom plates back. They should return shortly, and you should get an alert to pick up your Kism plates from Los Santos Customs for the car you made plates for earlier, wait 30 hours and continue. On day 15, steal a streetcar you can put in your garage and take it into Los Santos Customs and check for plate options. You should have your plates today. If you do not see your custom plates, try restarting the GTAV app and press L1 and R1 when the game is starting up and also restarting the Afrid app and cell phone. Create custom plates for a stock car in the iFruit app, keep selling clean cars and follow the pattern of what we just did. So day 16 through 19 would be. Day 16, sell car number 28 and number 29 wait 2 hours and sell car number 30 and number 31 till you reach day 20. On day 20, sell 2 cars back to back wait 2 hours, sell 2 more car C if you can sell 1 more car if you can then your selling limit is 5, wait 30 hours, so on and so on, make a chart. The current sales time frame is a 30 hour period. This is the function that blocks PV sales in the mod shop and produces the daily sell limit message. To start a selling strategy, it is important you do the following. Clear your window by not selling any vehicles for at least 30 hours, 1 day and 6 hours. Your 30 hour time frame begins at the sale of your first car. It ends 1 day and 6 hours later. The safest way to sell. Sell 1 car per hour and never more than 7 per 30 hours. Write the sale time down for each vehicle. If you accidentally sell three or more cars within two hours. Stop selling cars immediately and wait 30 hours before selling again. Never sell more than two cars in two hours or seven cars in a 30 hour period. Hope this video was helpful and if it was please smash that like button, hit that subscribe button and turn on all notifications. I hope you all are safe and are enjoying the rest of the summer with that being said. It's your boy so fly so Joe one and I am out peace.